All right, I'm going from one video straight to another. We are starting Corbin Burns on the mound today. Dude, he looks so fucking good. It's Corbin Burns, man. 107 hit per nine. He's got the cutter sinker combo, the curveball slider, and circle change after that. The control, pretty solid except for the sinker, interestingly enough, but it's got outliers, so it'll get away with a lot of missed pitches. Uh, he's got 107 hit per nine, which is pretty solid. A very balanced car with 100 uh, stamina. He's going to do great. I mean, Corbin Burns is nasty. It's what you expect out of him. So, let's get into a game. He's going to be the guy in the mound today. Lineup is going to stay the same. We're going to keep Seti out in center. Give him another game. Babe Ruth might be his super fractured game. Hitting 505 for us. He's doing pretty damn good. Carlos Delgado was a big piece of our offense. Let's see how the game goes. We are 58 and 10. We're 736 rating. Let's do it. Chris Sale. It's going to be tough. He's got a home run derby card in that lineup, too. Chris Sale's, Chris Sale's not an easy man to hit. Showing the lefty meta right there. He's going to be a tough guy. We're in ship at his record. 46 and 22. He's going to have to face Corbin. We're going to have to face Sale. Hits me. Interesting fuck up by him. Get down, ball. There we go. We get a little bit of cheese in the first. Babe Ruth can't find a way to not get a hit. <gasps> I swung at that. And I hit it in play almost to the warning track. We're just going to go up here and lock today. That's what we're going to stick with. Uh, Pinpoint has been a bit weird. It was jittering all over the place. Um, Could have fucked this over more than it did. We got lucky. Pure analog, though, it works. You kidding me? It works. I say that, but I'm going to pinpoint. Because I can't locate a pitch like that on pure analog. That's my own doing. But then look how easy that was to locate, you know? That's what you got to consider. There we go. We popped him up. Bit of elongated at bat, but that's not really our doing. A lot of foul balls for no reason. Holy shit, bro. Get the fuck out of here with that. This is some bullshit, man. Holy fuck the foul balls. Makes me definitely believe Caper 9 doesn't mean a fucking thing when Sandy Alcantara didn't struggle as much. shit bro this game oh i got him fuck man a swing and a miss it fucking happened i didn't believe it existed i didn't believe it fucking existed until then they fuck they fucking punished me that hard for that swing i could hit a homer with that swing i could i don't know what to do i don't know what to do man chris sale is really fucking hard to hit yeah, he's a bit late on it that time. I didn't think he'd really be turning up for the sinker again. Like he did the first time around there. What? Huh? That instantly makes me want to No, that instantly is making me go back to be and look. When you're fucking me over that bad? Sit the fuck down, man. You're scared. You don't have an eye. You're just scared. Yeah, if he's going to be too early on the sinker and cutter, I'm going to go to the circle change. Home run. Floated a slider over the plate. That was a horrible pitch. Holy shit, that was bad. Babe Ruth, you put a good fucking swing on it too. Fuck. Hate to see it. It was a good swing. That's a good swing on a circle change. Right in front of the warning track. 50 pitches through three form. That's going to be your first hit? I don't know if I'm crazy or something, but it looked like he was so late on that. 
fools, man. If he got to third because he didn't throw that in. He's so fucking ahead of them, but I just can't get him to swing and miss. No! N Stop! Bro, stop. You're somehow making worse and worse swings over the AB, and you're fouling them all off. And then you get to advance the runner. I mean, that's just dumb. He gets to advance the runner with one out. Every single one of them is lasting a while. That's a bad pitch. Need that more inside. Come on, more inside. Yup. It's a run, bro. I mean, God! Do you see it? Do you see the pitch? Bro! No, man! No! No! He doesn't get to make contact on that, man! That's a swing and a miss for him trying to swing at such an awkward, shitty pitch! Man, people thought fucking Alcantara wasn't gonna strike anyone out. What the fuck is this, man? Oh, and George Bright gets that run right back. Oh, yeah. Throws the circle, changes side of the sinker at the same spot. What are you thinking? You've had me turned up for the sinker at that spot the entire game. Throws in another circle change. This guy is just keen on throwing off speed right now. There's a bit of cheese. We get another hit. Okay, okay, here we go. We're getting a true rally going at this point. Double play, bro. No fucking way. Oh, if I was sitting on side, if I was sitting inside still, not worried about the sinker away, which to be fair, I should be. I should be worried about it. That could have been crushed. Fuck. Yeah, I mean he still makes contact right there, but that would have been nice with the runner on third. Hanging slider, swings at it, and they fucking let him get away with it. <sighs> he fouled that pitch off, bro. I mean, another walk. I mean, he's only walking batters because the guy's fouling off sliders that are just the most ridiculous shit you've ever seen. All right, a pop-up. Two out. I mean, man, this guy's having a pitch. His pitch count is... Stupid high for the fucking fourth inning, but sinker down the fucking middle. Fuck. Tried to just throw it up and away. It's a hard pitch to throw on Pierre Analog. What? I mean, I'm starting to hit him, and it's a, it's a one-run game with runners in scoring position. I mean, you fucking take out sale there. You can tell me that's not a home run. Oh my god, that left. Is that another circle change? Oh, this guy's fucking stupid. Bro, what are you doing? What is your deal with a circle change? We've scored one run every inning for the last three innings on this guy. Well, that is crushed, man. We should have more than one run every inning, man. The swings we put up this inning. The pool swing, the Alfonso swing... We got one of them to work out with Babe Ruth. Oh my god, is that his first strike? That's his fifth? Corbin Bruce has gotten five strikeouts. What? Okay. I didn't think he did. Oh, come on, Brett. Make that play with your diamond fielding. Alright, we're warming up the bullpen. Okay, there we go. Alright. Alright. This is such a this is such a sketchy start for a pitcher to only give up one run though. Like if he gives up one run through five, shit's just weird. Yep, one run through five. He made a nice swing there, but it's it's just gonna be right at the wall. Baber's gonna catch it. And then fucking doing that too. Holy shit! It would help if my PCI doesn't go fully under the strike zone. Corbin Burns, ah, uh, you're yellow. Do we give you a sixth inning? Nah, not with not with Gorman and Seeger coming up. We got to go to the lefty. I should have fucking known. 
Zach Britton, lefty lefty against Corey Seager. Good luck stopping him from getting a hit against the shift. Holy shit. Whew. Chased it. Zach Britton really no problem through an inning. He's having Chris Sale go fucking seven when he's giving up three. And he gives up four. Yeah, man. You can't be throwing sliders like that. I don't know what you're thinking. Dude, why try and switch it up? Cedric goes yard, lefty, lefty. Throws the slider inside, and it doesn't count because the guy fucking quit. What a piece of shit. He's finally going to get hit his first home run. This motherfucker quits. Gordon Burns goes parallel one. Really? He gets 587 to his 607. Are you serious? Five innings, one win, five Ks, 1.2 whip. With those three walks i guess because he still got he didn't get the complete game he didn't get those two rbis like he did maybe it doesn't count i feel like that's not big enough of a gap huh those were the two uh all-star game cards for the starters that i got right now i'll probably get more in the future but uh yeah see you guys in the next one peace